Good morning guys, happy Monday. I just woke up. I'm about to take the dogs on a walk and then probably do 12 3 30 if you guys are new here subscribe i'm just gonna take you through the day with me tomorrow my hardware gets put in and dom comes to town so we are gonna be staying at my lake house for the next few days so i need to kind of just gather smaller things around here to move the hardy people are moving the furniture for me but i don't want like just random stuff to kind of get lost i at least want to know where it is so we're doing that i have a lot of recordings things like that so i'll take you guys with me i shared this in my last vlog but i'm currently reading this book and it is like literally changing my entire life like it is the best book ever okay i took the dogs out i fed them i'm gonna go do 12 3 30 i'm listening to a podcast on brain health how to calm your anxiety i am like this book has literally changed my life i'm a very kind of like not i i don't want to say because it, it kind of sounds bad but like obsessive person but like when i'm into something i'm an all-in kind of gal that's what it is um so anyways that book has like legit just opened my eyes and so many things and i'm so excited and i want to do a video too as i'm like getting so oh Oh good, it didn't fall anywhere. I'm getting so ahead of myself because like I haven't even started this yet, but I'm so interested to see and it's just about eating for brain health and all these other things. By the way, I'm using this liquid IV thing in my water. Basically, it's a hydration multiplier and this is in passion fruit, non-GMO electrolyte drink mix. And I really like it. I've been drinking so much more water. My mom left, I have water bottles, my mom left this at my house when she came this weekend and I just started using it and I love it but I haven't used one while working out and I'm sure I'm gonna love it but anyways I'm listening to podcast on brain health I'm gonna start eating for brain health and like really focus on that there's plans I'll share more with you guys but I would definitely recommend the book that I'm reading maybe even get it in audiobook form or something if you're not a reader but personally I got it like physically which means I'm serious because I wanted to highlight and then potentially like give to other people and stuff because I knew it would be one of those reads and not like just my normal Kindle reads, which you can share books on Kindle, but not everyone has a Kindle. You know what I mean? Also, I just want to have a morning. Let's just list off three things that we're grateful for. This is inspired by looking at my viewfinder and seeing my beautiful, beautiful fridge. First thing I'm grateful for, um, my fridge. Second thing I'm grateful for, my dogs. Third thing I'm grateful for, podcasts. Everyone, comment down below three things you're grateful for. I'm trying to get also a lot more in the habit of doing a gratitude journal. I took an assessment and it showed me kind of potentially what my brain type is. And also, it said I should start doing gratitude journals. So, I know recently I've mentioned how I've been crying like so easily and just so often. And I've really never been a crier before. Like, I have cried more in probably the past like month or two than I have like in my life. Like, I'm just not a crier. And I did this assessment and it talked about like the limbic system and all of that stuff and I was like, oh my gosh, like that makes so much sense. So crazy. So anyways, this may be like totally not your vibe or whatever, but it's been interesting to me. I forgot I had a Botox appointment tomorrow, guys. <laughs> Alright guys, I worked out, I took the dogs out again. I'm back. It is almost 10. Yeah. I'm about to go shower and get ready for my day and then I need to record some stuff for the living room and then I also need to record for my podcast I love you so much podcast um, and then just send some stuff in I'm trying to get as much done as possible today just because Dom will be here and I won't be able to be in my house and whatever going to the lake but um, I just got this set this workout set in the mail Liz was wearing it the other day in a vlog and it's from Amazon literally both of these like these and this top guys $30. Okay, I will link it down below. They have other colors. The blue is definitely my favorite. I always take these pads off. They're literally the worst thing in swimsuit sports bras. Doesn't matter. They suck. I got a size medium because that's what it recommended to me, but I just think it is so cute, guys. Like $30 for both of these. Can you believe that? So I'll link that below for you guys in case you're interested. The quality is really incredible, and like I've seen Liz wear it, and it's so cute. So I'm really excited about that outfit. I'm gonna throw this away and get going with my day. Look what I've is made me drink so much more water. It just tastes so good. 
and it is like extra hydrating. I don't know how they do that, but it's kind of crazy, you know? But now I guess I'm just gonna drink normal water because I don't wanna, you know what? No, I'm not, I have an idea. Okay, we're gonna try this. It's the Liquid IV Energy Multiplier Supercharged Energy Drink Mix. So this is a 15 sick thing. I don't know, they just sent this to me. This is not sponsored, wish it was guys. I'm kind of trying to chill on the coffee, which I've honestly, I really have chilled on coffee. I really don't drink it as much as I used to. I wanna see how I like this. So it's lemon ginger. It kind of freaked me out because I was like, wait, is this like matcha? And it is matcha, but I mean like the matcha drink. I know I don't really drink, but I know that these are really good for people like the morning after drinking because it's really hydrating. So. All right, so I've just been getting rid of random things. Those frames need to be fixed. Um, not getting rid of, but I've just been putting them away. So I'm out of the shower. I just did my normal two-step skincare routine, which is the Ordinary Serum and then my sunscreen. Now I'm ready to go for the day. I actually did some cleaning downstairs, which I didn't vlog, but I have about an hour until I'm recording a car confessional for the living room, which is gonna be fun. This one's gonna be about breakups and healing from heartbreak, especially when it's like the person that you're gonna marry. This is my friend who's talking. But if you guys are interested in that, sign up for our Patreon. It's faith-based content. I'm also recording an episode for there. We have a lot of stuff going up there, guys. Like We have a lot going on. We're also reading through the Book of James. But anyways, I'm gonna go to the office. This is really what okay i have so many cords right now um i don't know where these sweatshorts are from guys they were sent to me and like i can't i just don't know black tank top just super simple and cozy as i'm working from home here we are also this is for the hardwood i think i might hang some stuff i don't really want to maybe there maybe i'll hang dolly or something i don't know but anyways you go in the office First off, I'm so excited for hardwood because this happened when we had that weird thing leak, whatever, blah, blah, blah. Um, I need to I need to move all of this stuff that I have and probably put it in here. This isn't organized as is, but like this can't be there anyway. So I'm going to have to figure this out today. I don't know. I'm like really not looking forward to it, to be honest. <laughs> I'm just moving things that need to be moved for when I get hardwood tomorrow. My closet is definitely not organized here. That is a project. Okay, is this going to fit? Please tell me if it's... Yes, it does. Thank God. My closet is a project that I will do, but anyways, that stuff, I'm, they'll just move to the bathroom, I'm sure. I'm just trying to kind of help them as much as possible, even though I'm paying for them to move this stuff as well, so I guess... So this stuff I'll eventually put back there. I can actually probably just move this at least right now. Um, but a lot of the miscellaneous stuff I've just moved in here. And I wish that that didn't slant down. I know it's a staircase under there, but it would be so nice if I was able to like put something in here to organize. How do you I just recorded an entire episode without my mic being plugged in to keep in orbit, but we recorded the episode for the living room and eight minutes I'm recording with Selena, so I'm actually gonna make lunch as I'm recording because it's like you basically hear us FaceTiming and talking about this stuff. And then um, after that, I'm gonna come back in and record the uh, intro for I Love You So Much. So, um, I don't mean to like toot my own horn, but Selena and I just killed that. Um, we also talked outside of the thing for like an hour and it was just like just what I needed and I just feel like it was such a good recording. So we shared on different topics from like growing up with parents with mental illness, growing up with divorced parents, relationships, not feeling like you deserve a healthy relationship. Like, I don't know, so much. And even if you're not like a faith person or like anything like that, like we talked, oh, and therapy, this certain kind of like trauma therapy that I really wanna do. But um, even if you're not into that thing, like these videos, I feel like are so helpful in their conversations that like, really like no one's really having publicly and like I feel like we're only able to do them in the living room just because it's behind a paywall and it's like a safer place but also it's like a community and who's like committed to growing it's just really freaking cool so 
Anyways, that's gonna be up on Friday, so check that out. We were also talking about probiotics um, off of the recording, but I'm about to record the intro for the podcast this week, and then um, probably just like plan a little bit more, do a little more, read my book, all that stuff, but yeah, I am really excited for that. I feel so much better now that I got off that call too. Not that I felt bad before, but I just feel great. So, hey guys, welcome back to the I Love You So Much podcast. I am your host, Kenzie Elizabeth. I'm so excited for today's episode. It is probably the most encouraging podcast episode you will ever listen to because we have Allie Williams on today. She's one of the greatest people in the entire world. So we will get to that soon. <laughs> Guys, I have Michelle's vlogs on right now, but I have been sitting here and finishing editing some videos. I'm about to pre-upload two videos, have those up. My cousin just texted me and she said she's coming over with ramen at six. So I need to probably at least start packing just because I have to be like in my den and I can't come back to my house, like normal part of my house until Thursday. So tomorrow at 8.30 they get here. And I think, well, I'm getting breakfast with Q in the morning. I know that. I know we have plans. He's been out of town. Um, and then I'll probably just only have access to my den. And then I have a Botox appointment at 1. And then I have to pick up Dom at 3.30. So then I'll bring the dogs because then from there, from picking her up, we're driving to the lake house. So that is the plan. So I need to make sure that I am prepared. So that is what I'm going to do. I had to figure that out. I wanted to go walk the lake, but I don't think that's really gonna happen today. All right, guys, I've gone ahead and packed for the lake. Um, I did a little bit of overpacking as always, but this is what I'm bringing. I will be out of my house, as I mentioned, the next three days, and we're just gonna go to the lake house. So we have a few things we're gonna do. I also just brought comfy clothes, and I'm gonna for sure bring my slides this time. Okay, here are my shoes to work out in and then I have my slides which I didn't bring to the lake last time and that was a huge mistake and then tomorrow I'm just gonna wear my air forces so I have them I also just curled my hair so that it would be so that I wouldn't have to do it in the morning thinking ahead I used to always do this when I would travel too and then I like second day curls better anyways my room feels so bare now that I took like those few accessories away I'm going to bring my base bag. This is the best bag ever. It fits so much stuff, but I put all my like toiletries at the bottom of this, which I'll just pack that tomorrow because I'll use them in the morning, and then I fill this with the rest of everything else, and it's just the best. Um, Twas the night before getting my floors redone. I'm feeding the pups and also I just poured more water in my thing. I am gonna bring it back to my mom tomorrow because I'm going to the lake house. I know I've already shown these in, vlog in the vlog, but this liquid IV, I cannot describe to you. Like, I'm just obsessed with it. I drink it, literally. This is my third pouch today, which is like definitely too much, but it just tastes so good. So anyways, Alyssa, my cousin, is on her way. She's picking up ramen for us. We're gonna watch Defending Jacob, which is exciting. <laughs> okay, Alyssa said I'm gonna love this, so really excited. All right, guys, Alyssa tried her, well, she's getting liquid IV. Alyssa yep. tried her liquid IV and loved it. So good, okay. Well, do I mix these? So here? yeah, what you do is, it might be beautiful. Um, easier to wherever we're eating it, do dump it, it in there. there. Do you know what I'm saying? Well, uh, yeah. So like, we should just go eat over we here. We should eat right at the table. Yeah, because if we sit on the couch, yeah, yeah. yeah. That couch. Guys, totally forgot to outro this vlog. We just watched Defending Jacob for the night, and then I went and read my brain health book and went to bed. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um, it is the next day. I'm vlogging. I'm just really keeping you guys updated this week, but I love you guys so much, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.